Hello again, everybody. It is your Black Knight. Here's another FOMO special. Another vehicle. I think you can get off the street. The Rancher XL. Classic suburban kind of thing, I think. That's the vibe I'm getting. He's something a little bit, a little smaller than that. What was it? Maybe just a four door blazer? Don't know where I'm going with this one. I really don't. A suspension. We'll lower it a little bit so it's easier to get into. That looks that looks right. I think there's not that much difference. What's interesting that dot on the floor? Just that the actual center of gravity dropping? I don't know. How do we want to do this one? We want to make it like a a burly off-roader or another kind of classy chassis kind of thing where if we go high end. Cheetah carbon ours. Is it calling? What about SUVs? That's gonna Is this an SUV? I don't even know. We're gonna have to figure that out too. Put some Kungs and Yeti wheels on it. Or is it just begging? Oh, let's see. We could go off road. But what about what about Chrome Mercenaries? Mer Chrome Mercenaries work. That's kind of on the same order of. If we don't want uh, the. Uh, Ooh, I don't know. Maybe this does beg for some off-roaders. The Doom Batchers are not very far off from the, the stock rims themselves. Raiders. Stock wheels. Versus Raiders. That's just what rims are attached. So we can, we can give it Raiders. Some chrome raiders, right? Tires, bulletproof. I think the off road, this does add something to it. Windows, light smoke. Performance wise, it's good, but are we keeping it yellow? It's just a two, it's a two tone. So let us go. Oh, here you go. That kinks. I want to do the same gasoline green. Do I want to keep it in, in like a livery here with the other vehicle? Maybe a Saxon blue and white. We could do another surf blue diamond blue combination. No, I know where we're going with this. I know what I'm doing. We're going gold with the pearlescent orange. And then put some pearlescent yellow, perhaps. See, is it orange that works with it, or is it just yellow? Yellow's down here, isn't it? Okay. Just to brighten up the gold. Secondary. There you go. Gold over white. That looks nice. I saw an old 50s Pontiac with this kind of color scheme on just the other day. It really looked nice. I 
not that much you can do with it. Not sure there's that much you can do with this. Not very quick. This might be slower than the Bobcat. Uh, what is it? Is it an SUV? It's an off-roader. Well, if it's in the off-roads class. And we should be able to take it off-road. Are we going to sell drugs here? Here we are. See, the, the people in this town, not the nicest. Well, you know, I think I sold to this guy before. I just, I already, uh, already tapped everything out there. So let us, let's just get this whole shitty odd thing rolling. I'm, I am curious, because here, here's my take so far on the, on this sucker. It is not fast. It does not have adequate power. But it's an off-roader, so it should have more than enough traction. It could, in theory, be all-wheel drive, or four-wheel drive. Could be either of them. It depends on how it's set up. It's certainly not an off-roader, the likes of which is that you would have to get this. This is not, not a great off-roader by any stretch of the imagination. And since you can't buy it, you should be able to grab it off the street, I think. So it's not super, super ultra rare. It's just not conveniently rare. It's, 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 it's inconvenient to get. Almost anything. You see, I have to go through both of those yet. They're not done. Almost anything you see here will probably climb this better than this thing. Will, but here we are. Well, a golden white mid-80s kind of looking Chevy. 90s, maybe. Maybe need something else. I don't know. But it's making me think about it. How well will this do? Well, it did very poorly. It's getting taken by the river. Oh, dear. Heavens to Murgatron. It was almost, almost pulled itself out of there. There's the train. That might take us three shots to get this, though, so hey. And yeet. That time it landed a little bit better. Gotta give ourselves... A, we're, we're stuck behind the train anyway. Couldn't even land it on. We landed on a rock. Oh, we were ahead of the train! We actually got ahead of the train there for a minute. We're gonna go for this. This is this is not what I meant by wanting to be ahead of the train. I think we're gonna. No, we're not. We're not getting ahead of the train. We sure did try, though, didn't we? Okay, so far it's not fast, but it's spunky. So let's see if spunky will carry it. We've already beat it up. The odds of it exploding on the way down are really good. The odds of it exploding on the way up are non-zero. It didn't explode while it was getting dragged along by the train, so we've got that going for us. Not a lot else going for us.
All right, we've got off-road tires, which means not much. I mean, if it's an old tires can flip car, that'll smooth some things out a little bit. Just a little bit. Hey, yeah, just a little bit. All right, but now, now is the time. Now we get to see if it's made of sterner stuff. It was pretty stern just taking a hit from the train. It's going, but it's not upshifting. We're not, we're not building momentum here. Let's see what happens. We're beat up. Don't forget. I don't feel like it's going to do it. I feel like we're going to get over this. Oh, come on. Come on, prove me wrong. This hump here, that's tough. Beat the bobcat. Beat the bobcat. All right, it is living up to its off-road name. This namesake this year, it's it's class. It's living up to its class. It's proving a tough little thing. It is bent all up, but you know, hey, still, so. still climbing. Still going too far. Still going way too far. Still, still going into a Chiliad disaster mode. Believe me, I know it's the wrong way. It's getting wronger and wronger as I try to do a K turn on the side of a mountain. That just floated over that hump. Oh, we're going to go all the way back. I don't want to go all the way back. I'm going to deal with the train again. It's an off-road. Look at that. Look at where we are. That was me, I think. I bumped the, they bumped the button. Should be able to do this. Oh, it's a heck of a recovery. The rancher is doing good. Is this a Vapid? Rancher, it's a Deluxe, it's a Classic, so it's a Chevy. Let me get Ranchero, it's a Ford thing. The Classic Rancher, we're calling it a Chevy, so it's like a a big trailblazer, some blazer. Suburbanite. Something. This is coming down a little faster than I want it to. Lots of brakes. Gas to try and goose it in the right direction. Ow. Is this a four-wheel drive? I don't know. Didn't look like it there. Remember, all cars are four-wheel slide. Over the tree. We're gonna explode, aren't we? Ow. Ow. Could we beat this thing up more? Yes, we could, but we're not going to. We're not going to dare the train again. You don't dare the train twice. Don't dare the train twice. Don't you get out of the train twice. Yeah. Funny if I just have a minor bump and go kaboom! 
That was all that was left. That's how video games work. You've only got so much health. You could program it, I guess, so that you could health to get down to a certain point, but if there's some minimum threshold then it would need to kill you. The train probably would be within that realm. Okay, let's see how the dismount goes. Yeah, that's about what you'd expect. Okay. I have to say, thus far, as we just pass a bobcat, I'd rather take this than a bobcat. Definitely a little quicker. A little more power, a little more traction. Better on a Fred. It's still not something you're going to win a Fred with unless... I don't know what to tell you. Maybe... Maybe... If it's snowing or raining or something like that. I don't think the sheer traction and, and weight will carry it through the bushes and under the jump. Boosh. But it did, it did have enough grip to climb. Oh, poor little wrencher. We put you through the mill, haven't we? Here it comes, hit by trains. Ooh, split the uprights. They didn't even flinch. It, it doesn't owe us much, does it? Now well, let's wrap this one up. What if I hadn't put competition suspension on that? Would it have flopped over more? I don't think that's a good thing. She's a winner. The Rancher XL, extra large. We'll take one last look. Because why not, I say, why not? So what does she have under the hood? Another big V8. Not the same engine model. Is it a V8? Is that like some kind of big inline? For, no, it's got to be something like an A, don't you think? That's exhaust runners, right? Not intake. Or is that intake runners? Like an inline four? I don't know. Nice brown interior. Goes good with the gold. That place to put the groceries. And on that note, ladies and gentlemen, it's big, it's square, it's a thing. I guess we'll keep it around for now. Especially since you can't buy them anymore. I could get them off the road, but only sometimes, and maybe not.
So on that note, ladies and gentlemen, this is your Black Knight. Have a great night. <laughs>